name is Dolor. Uh, I'm from the One Street team. Uh, well, uh, last couple of weeks, with our talk, a lot thanks to you, we were in New York, uh, Boston, San Francisco. We eat every day. We eat three times a day, at least. And every time we go to a different place. Well, when we open the menu, we find a lot of meals. We have a variety of options. And we usually stay there for two or three minutes and we pick a, a, pick a meal. Well, uh, this doesn't work for Didi. Didi is uh, vegetarian and has allergy to eggs. She has to be very conscious about what she orders. And that's why every time she goes to a restaurant, she opens the menu and looks for 10 or 15 minutes until she realizes that she has two or three options in the menu. Well, we made a uh, research and we realized that there is a 54 million people in the United States that have unavoidable food restrictions and they need to be cautious about their food. Uh, well, that's why we are working on OneTweet. OneTweet is a mobile application that helps people find food in restaurants nearby by uh, looking at their dietary needs and providing meal nutrition data. So how does it work? Uh, when our user sign up, he or she uh, enters that uh, their, his or her dietary needs and when our user look for food nearby, we provide a list of meals that fits their needs by using an artificial intelligence algorithm to match the nutrition data and the user needs. And this makes him her happy. So how we do this? We need a lot of data to do this. We need uh, new nutrition data and there are actually 300,000 restaurant menus currently on the web, on websites and uh, menu listing services. So we are going to use uh, automatic collection of the menus using information retrieval and data extraction techniques. And we are going to use artificial intelligence algorithm to extract the nutrition data. We are going to use uh, our users as a crowdsource for restaurant and menu data and we are going to improve our uh, information. Our paying customers are going to be uh, manufacturers of healthy food and restaurants that care about these 54 million people that have unavoidable food restriction, uh, food restriction and 200 million people in the United States that are conscious about their food. So our revenue model is based on a subscription model to the venues that are going to uh, have an option for pay $20 a month to manage their account and uh, branding their profiles. We're going to have an advertising for our manufacturers and our venues uh, that will be listed with the priority when they pay. So what is our go to market strategy? In the sixth month of first year, we're going to have a minimum viable product of our application. We're going to have 50,000 restaurants uh, data in our application. And we're going to start in San Francisco, where we find out that most of the restaurants have a gluten free food and they target people that have uh, food restrictions. So our early adopters are going to be gluten free people uh, that want to find food nearby. In the end of the year, we are going to have our first paying customers, which are going to be manufacturer of healthy food and uh, venues. Uh, in the second year, we are going national in the United States, having more than 250,000 restaurant data. And then we are going global and targeting all health aware users that care about healthy food. So, our financial projections show that we are going to uh, break even in the middle of the third year, based on our uh, spending about wages, uh, marketing and sales, and our customers, and revenue from the ads. We have competition. We all know Yelp, Foursquare, Urban Spoon that provide a way for people to find food in the restaurants, actually finding only restaurants nearby. Our advantage is that we have a niche market instead of these big players that are targeting everybody. We have people that really need the application, that uh, need the real food that feeds them, and we have the time nutrition information about the menu and we have a food-centric search, which means that instead of looking for restaurants nearby, we're providing the top three or four meals in the restaurant <coughs> that user can pick based on his or her needs. <coughs> so, can we do this? Our team consists of four people, 
George is our financial guru. He has experience in finances. There he is. Uh, Mila uh, has created uh, several startups of her own, and she has uh, experience in business development. She works in one of the best startup organizations in Bulgaria. Uh, I'm a software engineer with more, more than eight years of experience, <laughs> and uh, I'm currently studying data mining and artificial intelligence. Uh, Didi is our nutrition knowledge and our <coughs> dietary behavior. So we need $150,000 for the first year that are going to uh, cover our expenses and make us confident to find out more and work hard. So thank you.